Welcome to Cheers PA Beer Tours. In this episode, we're in Northwestern PA along one of the Great Lakes shores, ready to explore the Lake Erie Ale Trail and one of its 15 breweries. Whether you're visiting for their annual craft lager festival or enjoying live music and happy hours, you're bound to have a great time at Lavery Brewing Company in Erie, PA. I'm here at Lavery Brewing Company with Jason Lavery, one of the co-owners of the brewery. Jason, tell me a little bit about the history of Lavery. Like, how long have you all been open and what made you come up with this crazy idea to start a brewery? Start a brewery, <laughs> yeah. So yeah, my brother-in-law got me into home brewing in 2004 and he uh, had a homebrew kit and it kind of was like this weird moment where I never even realize that like people make beer. Like I was still like 22 years old and just the concept of like, oh, like that's really cool. And so I absolutely fell in love with it. Two months later, my wife got me a homebrew kit and I started doing it every single weekend. So. Oh wow. So what was it like starting a craft brewery in 2009 in Erie? I mean, when you were working that job at the brew pub, was it a lot of craft or more like macro type stuff? Like yeah, no, they're still around the brewery. It's uh, Erie's original brew pub is very cool. The first beer we ever brewed was a pumpkin ale and then we did like a smoked porter. So we weren't really brewing hoppy beers for the first three years we were around. And then Sam Adams had excess hops in 2012. So we started doing like a session IPA and uh, nice. named it Dulacon, which is kind of like a leprechaun, but he's like a grim reaper in like Irish folklore. <laughs> what was the response from the public? I mean, were the people of Erie like, really receptive to craft beer or was there kind of like an educational curve? Yeah, I mean, we were very lucky that we had the breweries that led the way before us. So Erie Brewing's been around since 1994. Voodoo started in 2006. Brew Erie started in 2006. Those breweries like took me under their wing. I visited every brewery I could possibly visit, you know, brewed on everybody's brew house. Okay. So for the first three years, we were pretty much just selling growler hours. Gotcha. Um, until we opened this pub three years later. Now that we had the the avenue to sell our beer directly to retail to customers was really game changer Absolutely. for us. Cool. Well, what are I know that you have the craft lager fest coming up, or is it a lager only fest? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can Absolutely. you tell me a little bit about that? So this is the fifth annual craft lager fest. Everybody brings their favorite lagers, and cool. yeah, we just rock and roll. We that got an UPA band on the stage. We do beer Olympics, so keg rolling. Oh man. Uh, we do. Uh, are they full kegs? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like a rolling for an obstacle course. So. I'm actually I'm drinking the lager, yeah. the Lavery Lager of Brewers Beer. Yeah. Exactly. Um, yeah, this is delicious, Thank Chris. You. Clean. What are you drinking? Gold Leopard. It has a French Saison yeast, a lot of uh, Belgian Pilsner malt, a little bit of oats, and a little bit of Vienna malt. So it's real crushable. It has a lot of those like Belgian Saison like phenolics, real fruity and grassy. What are some of the coolest parts about Erie? The coolest part of Erie, I think, is the beach. You know, we're on the Great Lakes. You know, we're on Lake Erie. So Presque Isle used to be an island and now it's actually connected to the land. So we have 11 awesome sandy beaches. Cool. And it's an open container city, so you can walk around with a no beer. No way. Absolutely. <laughs> Well, cheers. Cheers. Thank you. <laughs> you. you can't have porters without ports, and Erie has plenty of those. Today, we're visiting the Erie Maritime Museum, and then we're going to sail into the sunset with Captain Chris on the Letty G. Howard. My name is Captain Chris Cousin, and we have a wonderful evening ahead of us. All right, are we ready on the throat halyard? Are we ready in the peak halyard? Ready. All right, throwing peak, hallway. 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 Is there a way that we're ready? Ease 
Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this episode. Be sure to follow us online, tell us your favorite spots, and let us know where you want us to go next. Cheers, PA. My name is Logan Harpins. I'm the head brewer here at Lavery Brewing Company in Erie, PA. And my favorite beer to brew would be not really a certain style per se, but just in general, any brew day that there's a twist to the normal brew day. So like Kolsch, we're doing like a step mash, so that's a little bit different from a single infusion mash or something like a wet hop lager where we're using uh, whole cone hops instead of pellets. Just makes uh, the brew day a little bit more interesting.